I got an AO Smith Pro Max plus high efficiency water heater. Uh, they came out to my property yesterday and turned off the gas for uh, to check leaks in my propane tank. And sorry, it's windy. Um, they shut off the gas and they turned off my hot water heater. After they fixed the gas line, they said, "Oh, you can't get your pilot to relight." Uh, couldn't find anything with my specific model. Thought I was gonna have to replace the unit. Called the service guy out. He walked out, looked at the tank, and said, "Oh, this is old. I don't have the parts for it. I can't fix it. Uh, it's gonna be fifteen hundred dollars to replace your unit." So then I got the model number, model number, serial number, and everything, which is located right there. Took a picture of it. Started doing research. Started watching videos on YouTube on how to replace it, and even went and bought a kit today that replaces, it's a, a pilot light kit, so it's going to replace all this stuff right here. Um, decided, you know what, if I'm going to replace it, I already got it ordered, let's take it out and clean it. That's all I did. Took it out and cleaned it. Couldn't get the pilot to light yesterday. Technician tried, I tried, and the guy that uh, filled my propane tanks, he tried. And in this little sight glass, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it. Yeah, we got flame. So what had happened, I took these two screws out, right here and right here. Ooh, those are hot. I disconnected these three lines, okay. Um, thermocouple, gas line, and then your uh, pilot light. And then I disconnected this, which is your ignition for your pilot. Disconnected those, pulled this unit out, picked it up, pulled it out, and noticed that the pilot was really um, uh, corroded. So I got 80 grit sandpaper, sanded it down, the pilot light, and honestly, put it back in there. Well, first I hooked this cable back up, made sure I touched the end of it on the inside, the pilot, touched it and hit the switch and felt it on my finger that I had spark, which I did not before. Put it back in there, put everything up, hooked it all up, checked it for leaks, tightened these down just you know a little bit to where it would hold in place in case I had to take it back out. Turned it to pilot right here, pushed down, held it for about 15 seconds and clicked it once and the thing fired up immediately. So don't always trust a repairman because the way I see it, he just wanted to make 1500 bucks minus you know a $500 unit, $600 unit. Um, so he would have made out like a bandit. Clean your contacts, that's all I gotta say. Just clean the contacts. It's an AO Smith uh, Pro Max Plus High Efficiency pretty basic unit um, so yeah don't always trust a repairman get in there and if you ordered the parts already you might as well troubleshoot try to clean the contacts and that's all I had to do so now I can cancel the order on that shipment or keep it just in case this one actually does go out in the future uh, yeah it's a quick little video I'm not gonna take it back apart because it's running so thanks for watching